Some Jackson restaurants say they're getting back to normal after enduring the city's 48-day boil water notice. 12 News' Brandon Rain spoke with uh, some owners who say it's a welcome sight to have customers and water back. After nearly seven weeks under a boil water notice, Jackson restaurants are starting to bounce back. You know, lifting of the boil water notice has changed a lot of people's mindset. Restaurants like Lou's Full Serve and the Iron Horse Grill saw a dip in customers during the notice. But they say customers are coming back since the notice was lifted on Monday. It's definitely, definitely been a positive upturn uh, in the last, uh, I guess maybe, you know, last week or so. Um, we've definitely seen it uptick. Which... You know, for the first bus, I think we've seen here in over a couple weeks. So uh, it's very welcome news for the restaurant to be, to be busy. Busy is good. Louis LaRose at Lou's Full Serve is also thinking state officials for encouraging residents to return to their favorite restaurants through incentives like the Visit Jackson Restaurant Tour. I definitely appreciate, you know, people getting out there and putting the word out to support these businesses like ours. Um, like I said, every little bit helps. Restaurants were spending thousands of dollars a week during the water advisory buying canned drinks, ice, and water. Those costs are now declining. We're, we're, we're back to kind of normal levels of things like that. Expenditures on, you know, fountain drinks as opposed to having to buy canned drinks for everybody. So definitely that's, you know, that's definitely helped cut the costs for sure. Management at Lou's is also relieved they no longer have to cut back on staff hours. We have an obligation to open our doors every day for our staff because we promise them gainful employment and a good place to work. Restaurant owners say they from where they were before the boil water notice, but they are hopeful for the future. Reporting in Jackson, I'm Brandon Rains for 12 News.